Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, the new game mode is out for GT Sport. And this is the Lewis Hamilton Time Trial Challenge, as you can see there. Basically, you have to beat Lewis Hamilton in any of these things. Uh, I'm going to go for Monza, because I think that's where I'll be least worst. But looking at that time, I think I'm going to have a real tough struggle at it. And also, if you look at the leaderboards, you see he's done a 46.9. And... Uh, you know, that's not far off the top 10 at the moment, so it's going to be quite difficult to say the least. So we're going to try our best to you know, see if we can get close. You don't have to beat him to get gold. You only have to do a 148 to get gold. I think even that's going to be tough for me. But we'll try it and uh, see how it goes. Let's just first get some driving tips from the man himself. Monza is known for being uh, a very historic circuit, being that in the olden days they had the banked uh, circuit which is still there in uh, the midst of the trees and everything um, and the banking was incredible I wish that we could still use that today but the track that we get to race today is still pretty epic it's, it's unique in its own way being that it's obviously shaped like a boot and uh, it's all long straights and very very slow chicanes um, and the small lesmos at the back but it's a real great combination of corners and it's very fast <laughs> So it's really all about the exit, the speed you carry into the corner, but mostly sacrificing a bit of the speed into the corner to make sure you get to full throttle sooner. The sooner you can get to full throttle, the speed that you carry down the straight pays dividends. And it's a heavy braking circuit as well, being that you're braking from high speed most of the time to almost a standstill in the chicanes. And you do need to be quite aggressive on some of the curves here. And yeah, it's just really about trying to find that balance, as I said, between going too fast in or too slow out or too slow in and, and fast out. Um, but I love this track and crazy enough as I'm recording this, I'm about to go and race there this week. So uh, I hope that you enjoy it. Hopefully we can like, you know, we'll at least get silver, I would think. Um, so gold would be the second best and then obviously beating Lewis would be peak performance. But yeah, I'm not gonna hold my breath for that one. Oh, you got the split to Lewis. At the moment, I'm faster than him, so we can just end it right there, and that'll be good. Now I'm gonna, now we're gonna see things change because my braking was shite. Yeah, you see how bad I took that corner. I lost half, over half a second. So that's great. I guess I can break a bit later in that first corner, and then not go in with so much speed as well. So to the second chicane, thankfully not as tight as the first one. Oh, but I've not really got on the brakes, have I? God, he made up a lot of time there. Holy shit. <laughs> oh my. Okay, that's not ideal. Okay, let's just retry because that was so far down on pace. This is probably going to be one of the hardest things ever in a game. Like, it would be really cool if other games had it, I suppose. But, you know, when they do it in Forzone, you have to beat any of those guys in their rivals events. They don't really play the game, and it's not the kind of game that's terribly realistic to the point where, you know, you'll be good if you are good in real life. Okay, that was, that was a bit better, actually. Are we going to be up by the time we get to De La Rogia? We'll see, no, not quite. This is where he made up so much time, it's actually ridiculous. Ooh, we're up! We're up on Hamilton! Oh, god damn it! <laughs> yeah, so that was encouraging. We did something. Now we just need to put the whole lap together. But I think first we need to walk before we can run and get through De La Rosia, fine. It's a bit different from what I've been driving lately, and that's a lot of the MX-5 touring on Sakuba, so pretty much a different animal altogether. Let's get through here, and that's also on not quite on hard tyres, it's on soft Oh, that was even better. Holy shit. Get wrecked, Lewis. But now, now we're going to struggle. Almost a tenth up. The brakes a little earlier than the lines. I've never been good at this corner in any game. Look at 
that. I lost so much time. I gained a little bit back on the uh, on the exit. I hate the first Lesmo. Second Lesmo is a bit nicer. But we've lost God, nearly a second just through the Lesmos. And we got a Skyri coming up now, which is probably gonna be worse. Okay, we're through there alive. I think that's gonna be a little bit of a penalty. No penalty, I think the, the uh, Sam saved me there. I don't think I'm even gonna be getting gold right now. Yeah, way too late onto the brakes, damn it. And then too early on the throttle. He was a bit, uh, I think, cautious on the throttle there, in the exit. So Lewis, if you're watching, uh, you can improve just through the first corner there. Just get on the power a little bit earlier. And uh, I think you're going to see your lap time tumbling. Uh, as far as the rest of the track's concerned, I'm willing to take some advice from you. Okay, I'm going to decide for that corner. I'm going to not get on the brakes so hard because I think that's why I was getting a little bit of... Oh god, I the grass there. A little bit of oversteer. This is going to be dreadful up to Ascari. I'm going to try to take Ascari in fourth to see what happens. But I am a lot worse than he is. Holy shit, he's been through Ascari. My god. I know I'm bad, but my god, I didn't think he'd be that far that much faster through his car. Okay, and he's good through parabolica too. So I've lost a tenth through parabolica, lost god knows how much time through Ascari. The Lesmos were a problem. That's a great time. It's not a great time, Lewis. It's quite far off your time. What happens if you do a really crap time? What does he say? Let's find out. No, nope. more practice. Yeah, I know, I need more practice. Okay. You could be a bit more harsh about it, I think. Scurry, you son of a bitch. How do I gain on the straight? Like midway through the straight. This is like Mr. Shift or something. Oh my god! How did I make it through there alive? I'm still not quite on pace for gold. And certainly not on pace for Lewis. I'm taking the F1 line here. So I'm going to improve a bit, but it's not great. Okay, we're closer to gold. That's a great time. It's not a great time. Come on, Lewis. just an absolute abortion. That was terrible. That was a good, good corner. Now we're coming up to our second biggest nemesis on this track. Was all right. There we go. We finally got the second Lesmo right. Not breaking too early and hitting grass. And all hitting grass. No, oh, fuck. There's no time here. Yeah. Oh, not bad. Not great, but not bad. Come on, we can do this. 
can't beat Lewis, but we can get gold. Come on, boy. Get it right. Get parabolic right. Here we go. We've lost a bit of time, but it's not too bad, actually. We're going to get gold. Hell yeah, we're going to get gold. Yeah. 47.5. Wow. I'm impressed. Thank you. Thank you, Lewis. What a guy. You know, he's actually impressed with my time. What a gentleman. He's a gentleman and a scholar. Not quite there. We're about just under six tenths, actually. So I'll take that for now. Being a completely useless, plebe YouTuber. I'll come back eventually once I'm. Oh, I got a million credits, boy! Yes, that's what I needed. But in group three, for me at the moment, that's okay. On a track I'm not a huge fan of. How the hell did I get diamond? What the hell is diamond? I got gold. So why did I win a million? Is diamond beating Hamilton? Because I didn't beat him, so why did I get a million credits? <laughs> but hey, I'm not going to argue with it. Um, but it is like a cool little take on hot lapping. Uh, that you, know, you don't really see pretty much anywhere else. Project Cars occasionally has those, or had those weekly events where you could race against racing drivers and beat their times. Actually, we had uh, Lewis Hamilton's brother was one of them just after the game came out. But this is like a permanent thing. So, yeah, it's really, really cool. I like the idea. And like I said earlier, it wouldn't really work for Forza because, you know, your real world driving doesn't really translate to Forza. You have to know how to play Forza. Whereas in this game, if you're good in real life, you'll be good in the game. So I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Definitely something different. I have been playing a lot of this game lately. I have got a multiplayer video planned. I just have to... I've done about seven races for it. And I'm just trying to get you know, the right one. So I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, go ahead and leave a like. If you're around here, go ahead and subscribe. And I shall see you guys in my next video.